the managing director and chief executive officer of Innocent Motors, Innocent Chukuma, has pleaded with Nigerians to be patient with the administration of President Bola Tinumbu. Speaking with newsmen on Thursday after visiting the president of uh, the state house, Abuja, Chukuma, who said his visit was to encourage the president, stated emphatically that president has the capacity to turn Nigeria around for the better. He also accused former president Muhammadu Buhari of selling crude oil upfront while his eight year tenure as president lasted. Let's hear from Innocent himself. Yes. Let them give him time. Everything they want, they will see the better of Nigeria. They will give him a short time. Let everyone come down for him. I'm begging Nigeria for people, for people to come down. That um, they will see the better Nigeria from him. And I believe that. Okay, apart from that, mm. you think, um, we expect as partnership between the government and the innocent. Yes, um, we government is doing their best on innocent motors, and um, the partnerships are going on, and. Um, in a short time, in Nigeria, you everywhere you go, you see nothing matters. Okay. Yes. The info now is about CNG. Uh, okay. I started. I started CNG about two years ago, and the first person that started about CNG in Nigeria, and um, as I come here today, the CNG issue of uh, a vehicle issue will be over. I've discussed with them, and they will see that uh, in a short time, masses, public, we have enough. CNG buses on the roads. So what is your own assessment of the uh, government initiative on CNG? It's, it's the best idea. Government initiative on CNG is the best idea for transportation in this country. Because CNG, a lot of benefit on CNG, using CNG to use CNG. Uh, because that, that benefit is what I see before I started the factory to produce vehicle on CNG. Because I have, I have started producing the CNG before the announcement. So today, everybody that tries CNG will discover that CNG is well forward for this nation. Yes. And uh, let everybody get patient because everybody knows that the former government so died, corrected the money, don't supply. This government is just supplying. They haven't get the money. So let them give them a chance. Everything will be okay the way I see him. He wants better of this country. So I'm encouraging everybody to get patient, not to, to destroy our things. Destroy cannot benefit. There's no benefit to destroy. Our benefit is to remain and give him chance to go, to become, to plan for the future of this country. That's my own point. All right, you have heard from Mr. Innocent Chukuma himself. He said at a time like this, he would go and visit Mr. President to encourage him. But then in, in his interview, one of them, uh, uh, I would like to say one or two things about what he said. He said the government is doing their best on innocent motors because very soon we'll start seeing innocent motors everywhere. I would like the Nigerians to know that. People will not come out to talk about this administration if it is not in their own favor. Because the reason why he's asking Nigerians to be patient is because innocent motto is involved. And if this man had been, if he had wanted to be, if he had wanted to be just enough, he would have seen that if at all, um, this administration would want to invest in a CNG because according to him, he said he started CNG um, uh, motors even before Mr. President began to talk about CNG initiatives and all of that. If this administration had wanted to support business owners like him, as please, as at the time that Mr. President bought new SUVs for his lawmakers, instead of buying SUVs, he would have patronized Innocent. The Toyotas that we saw fall, that followed Mr. President when he had his visiting in, to Lagos, over 40 Toyota uh, Prados that followed Mr. President, it could have been innocent motors. At least when our leaders in the, um, in the country, when they are beginning to patronize our locally owned brands, then we would understand that this administration is interested in investing in our people. You know, they're always talking about foreign investors. Foreign, you are looking for foreign investors, but you are not attracting your local investors. So I think Mr. Chukuma is, should have seen that if at all this administration wants to invest in local brands, 
they would have started with him. They would have bought innocent motors. They would have been using innocent motors themselves. They would have used innocent motors to, to you know, to to make ad adverts that if we can use it, then you can patronize Innocent Motors. And before you know it, Innocent Motors will become an internationally known brand where people would be interested in coming into the country to come and buy Innocent Motors instead of, you know, instead of going out to get um, foreign brands that is further weakening our Naira. So that is that. And we see that even when we saw how the Nigerian government frustrated Airpeace, Airpeace Airways, before they got their license. And that is what we see happening again. So Mr. Chukuma Innocent is speaking for himself here that very soon you will start seeing Innocent Motors. That is the major reason that took him there. So Nigerians are wondering why he's telling us to be patient when whatever you went to discuss with Mr. President is only will start using cng buses very soon we should understand that cng buses is not free and we can see that the ploy of this administration is that they want to divert our attention from petroleum to cng and as soon as our attention is diverted to cng they will inflate the price and nigerians would have no cho have no choice but to shuffle between cng and petroleum while the prices are at the same reach so another thing that he said is that the former government sold oil they sold oil and they are not getting the money. As they sold oil, they got the money, and we didn't see what the money is being used for in the admin in um in the country. So that is for the last eight years. But let's talk about where we are today. Let's talk about where we are today. Today he said the government is just supplying and hasn't made money. Now the question is, who are the government supplying to? Because Mr. Dangote, the, the uh um the owner of Dangote refinery had said that he the the crude oil in Nigeria cannot cannot the refinery in Nigeria rather cannot supply all of the crude that he needs because he would be needing more than 20 million barrel per day and we see that what the Nigerian government are supplying is not enough and if at all they are selling the first question is who are they selling to the second question is that if they are selling to others why are they not selling to Dangote refinery why are they frustrating the man from furthering his business what exactly do they want to attain from that so that is the question that is has been coming into the heart of nigerians as to what mr innocent shukuma has said because here it seems like he's speaking only in favor of himself and this administration and whatever it is that, because he didn't outline why exactly he went to uh, um he went to visit mr president he only said few of them he only mentioned that he went to encourage him what other conversations did he have with mr president that led to some other things that he said that is still um it has left nigerians in darkness as to what exactly was discussed behind closed doors so on this note this is all that will be taken on the segment for the newspaper review but before we leave the studio we would like that you follow us on all our social media platform on facebook we are prime media tv on instagram and tiktok we are prime media studios on the website where you're currently watching us we are enginespeak.com and you can do well to follow us on youtube at enginespeak i am ayo until i come your way again please do have a great day <laughs>